So we're here with AIA Labs. So who are you? I'm Joyce, I'm the creative director for AIA Labs. We're based in Toronto. We have an 80,000 square foot facility and our focus is embedding technology into textile form factor. So what goes on as this? Uh, this is a... This is a video of our facilities in Toronto. Again, we have a, a, like a printed lab. We have a, a seamless knitting lab as well as a traditional cut and sew facility. And some of the products we produce are our EL lights. This is a backpack cover. All right. So electroluminescent lighting. Nice. Uh, let's look over here. So what are we looking at here? At AIA Labs, we work with two kinds of technology. We work with printed technology, similar to this. This is just been printed on a film. And then we also have knitted technology, which is similar to this. And I'll just pull you over to the mannequin over here. Yeah. <laughs> so this is a compression shirt with ECG sensors a thoracic and abdominal breathing volume measurement. So we have a lot of biometric products as well as... So it's fully flexible? For, yes, and washable. And what is, it, what is it able to measure? And you need this uh, for it to yeah. work? This one is a biometric uh, heart rate monitor bra, sports bra, and you can clip in any generic uh, heart sensor or heart rate monitor, so like Polar or Garmin, you just slap it in. So it's fully washable. And on the outside is one of the first products we're launching is our Vagulum collection. What is that? Vagulum means firefly in Portuguese. So Vagulum collection is for what? It's for a safe or enhancing visibility no, no, no. collection. So we do a lot of vests. Yeah. And if vests are a little bit too niche, we have jackets as well. Ah, it's sliding up right here. And again, it's so, how does it work? It's powered by a DC inverter that converts DC voltage into AC current. And the beauty about it is that it can embed very naturally into clothing. But what is it that makes the light? That makes the... It's electrical charge that charges or excites a phosphor. And the phosphor is a, a, like electroluminescent, for electroluminescent lighting. And so, uh, it's, it's always kind of like bluish? Blue? Yeah. It, it's only blue? And what we use is a blue-green phosphor, so it can be anywhere between a, a whitish blue to a green. That's the best, most efficient lighting. But the, the phosphor actually comes in five natural colors. Blue, blue-green, green, white, and orange. All right, so there's going to be lots of stuff happening with the uh, textile and smart textiles. We hope, we hope for sure. <laughs> That's why we're here. And here you have uh, something that goes in the, for the shoe. Yeah. This is a, it's printed on a film that you can put in an insole and into your shoes, so it can measure gait analysis, for example. So, gait analysis, so it's like, what does it measure? Your walking pattern and how you distribute your weight, for example. So, they say gait analysis can help predict um, stroke, for example. And uh, this, the same system? Yeah. Same style system? We have printed sensors, so you can use them in different patterns. Sometimes it's a measure uh, movement, so how you're walking, or maybe if you put it in a, in a slipper or something, you can track if you're doing poses right, or if your walking pattern's accurate. We also have switch sensors, which is, again, printed. It can be on a stretchable film or a non-stretchable film. And imagine it being on the cuff of your jacket, so you can pick up a call or dial out. So Are those buttons? Yeah. There's switch sensors that you can use as buttons on a shirt. But how, where would it be connected to what? Well, these are the silver conductive um, traces that you would connect to, connect to a device. It could be a, a tiny device that you can that has Bluetooth power, for example. All right. And that could feature your phone. Cool. So much more coming later, right? With uh... For sure. Yeah. Watch out for us at aialabs.ca.